Hi guys, I'm Dr. Sandeep, your surgery guy. I'm here to talk about the FMG exam Jan 2023. We have 39 days odd, let's plan. We have to plan every single day and we have to plan every single session of the day from here on in order to achieve what we have been striving for. So we have odd 39 days. The last four days will be taken for your revision, uh, you know, to look up all the previous exam questions, all the important uh, signs, all the important tables, all the classification that you've looked, that is the last four days part. So we have roughly 35 days. In these 35 days, you have to make a point that every part of the day has to be utilized evenly. So we'll keep it this way. We have 19 days, so I'm going to assign each subject a particular day so that we'll be able to understand that how well we can revise. But today, you have to promise yourself from here onwards, we are going to do 100 MCQs per day, right? We have 35 days, we'll be doing 3500 MCQs. Now the standard rule or a golden rule that we have is you have to do at least last five sessions of the MCQs before going to the exam. If you take last five sessions, 300 questions per session, last five sessions accounts for 1500 questions. We are doing 3500. That means what? We'll be doing double the amount, right? So this will give you confidence. At the same time, it will also give you the habit of practicing questions, right? We'll also give GTs as and whenever possible in our preparatory time, but this is the plan we wanna stick to. When you look at the 100 questions, no, you feel it's a lot, right? 100 questions. Now here is the point. Divide the day into four sessions. Each session, we will do 25 MCQs that will account for 100. For example, you wake up at morning 7 o'clock. So our 7 to afternoon, let's say around 1 o'clock, we have session number 1. From 2, you take a lunch break around 1 to 2. From 2 to 5, your second session. 6 to 9 is the third session. And night 10 to 12 is the last session. You can go to bed at 12. Now, how I would plan is, in the morning session, I will do 25 MCQs first and then read a subject. That is your notes, right? Afternoon session, I will only do 25 MCQs. I will not read any notes. Evening sessions, I will read again. I will do MCQs, there is 25. Along with that, I will read some subject. And at night, I will only do 25 questions, right? And sleep. So what it's doing is, it has given me two sessions to revise my notes and four sessions to do MCQs. So you'll get a good habit of practicing. That is your first attempt and the first rule. From here onwards, I will now try to assign that how well can we plan day-wise in order to achieve our goal. So let's talk about day-wise plan and subject-wise, right? Before you do so, you need to have a clarity of thought that which subject would you like to read notes as well as previous year MCQs and topics and which subject will limit ourselves to previous year topics and questions, right? For example, anatomy, physio, biochem. We will be only doing previous year topics and previous year questions, right? When you come down to second year, pharmacology, your pathology, your microbiology, these three subjects, you will do both notes. Along with that, you will do your previous year questions as well. PSM, again, you have to do your notes as well as previous year questions. ENT, ophthal pediatrics, notes as well as your previous year questions. Forensic medicine, only previous year questions and topics are more than enough. Surgery, medicine, ops and gynae, you have to do notes. There is no if and but. With that, you have to do questions and topics of your previous year exam. Your ortho, derma, psychiatry, anesthesia, radio, stick to only previous year topics and your MCQ. So now you have the clarity of thought that which subjects we have to do both and which subjects we're going to concentrate only on your previous year topics. Now, let's lay down the plan. From tomorrow onwards, day one, day two, day three. We have three days. These first three days, I will do anatomy, which is only MCQs with previous year topics, with pathology, where I'll be doing both the notes as well as your previous year questions. Take it. Next to day four, day five, day, day six, we'll do physio, pharma, physio only MCQs, pharma both, right? Then your day seven, day eight, day nine, we will do biochemistry with PSM. Biochemistry only MCQs, PSM will be doing both MCQs as well as notes, right? Day 10, day 11, micro and derma. Day 12, day 13, we'll do ENT with radio. Day 14, day 15, day 16, OBG with ortho. Day 17, day 18, ophthal and anesthesia. 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. Five days I've given you for surgery and psychiatry. 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, only medicine, no indulgence. 29, 30, pediatrics and your forensic medicine. You will be done by 30 days. I've given you another five days for your buffer and the last four days for your revision. Stick to this plan, we'll execute it. Continue do that 100 questions while of under. You will just sail through, right? There is nothing which can stop you the last, this last month, no. You have to just shut it everything out. Believe in the process, believe in yourself. Let that negative energy just wipe it away.